Hello everyone, in today's video we are gonna see the difference between practice and practice. This difference between section practice, first one, second one, practice, with C, first one, with S. In this section, we are gonna learn the answers of three questions written here. First one, is there any pronunciation difference between practice with C and practice with S? Second one, what does practice with C mean in British and American English? And third one, what does practice with S mean in British and American English? And let's start. Practice with C. Let's make it pronounce the word. I have taken the pronunciation from forward.com. Practice, 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 practice. The meaning. It's a systematic training by multiple repetition. Repeat, repeat, and repeat again. It's like an exercise to be better at something. In British English, practice with C is a noun. Is a noun. In American English, practice is both noun and verb. Practice. Let's see the examples. Silvana suggested making more practice to be good at speaking both British and American English. Here is Silvana, and she is speaking to make practice, and both in American, both in British English. What's that flag? Oh my God! It's Brazil flag. What did I put here? Anyway, and practice. Noun both in British and American English. What of them? It's noun. Practice with C. And the second example. She also said that if you want to be better at American accent, you should practice the American English more. It's the verb. Let's make more practice in American ex English because we want to make our American accent better. Practice is the verb one. The practice, the verb practice with C, just verb in American English, not in British English. Don't forget, the practice with C just is used in American English as a verb. And practice with S. Let's see its pronunciation. Practice, 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 practice. There is no such a thing in American English. There is no practice with S, S in American English. In British English, it's the verb form of practice. It's the verb form of practice with C. Let's go to the examples. In light of the deep knowledge of Jacob with the English learning exercises shared by Dumbo, thank you Dumbo, we practice at a school located in England. As illustrated, here's the Jacob, um, Jacob, sorry, there's a book here, so it's a big scholar as you see, no lots of things here and thinking all the time. And this delight in light of the deep knowledge of Jacob, supported with the English learning exercises made by Dumbo. Here is the Dumbo. He's studying here. Lots of books there. And this is the exercises, reading passages here. He is all the time sharing these exercises with the people to teach them more and more. An humble guy. And we practice at a school located in England. Practice with S. Verb in British, but not American. It's verb just using British. There is no such a thing in American English. Last but not least, commonly, other than British and American English, you know, there are English types in other countries, for example, Australian English, other English types. Practice with C is used as a noun, and practice with S is a verb. Used as a verb. It's the common. It's commonly used form of practice with C and practice with S. I can say that the practice type, which is used in British English, can be commonly used in other countries, except in American English. Let, uh, let's answer the questions. I promise at the beginning of the video, I said that after this video, you are gonna learn the answers of this question. Let's answer it. Is there any pronunciation difference between practice with C and practice with S? No, there is no pronunciation difference. Both are pronounced in the same way. What does practice with S mean in British and American English? Practice with S is just verb in British English. There is nothing in American. There is no such a thing. Doesn't exist exist in American. What does practice with C mean in British and American English? Practice with C is noun in British English. Just noun. In American English both is noun and verb, as you see. Thank you for listening to me. Please do not forget to subscribe and like and share. You want to aware of the coming videos, but other words, and you can check my playlist, my YouTube channel, if you wonder what kind of contents I am I'm uploading to YouTube. Thank you. See you next.